Right, here we go again. Where are we? We're up at Kilnsey. Come up for his lunch. We're at the Crown and Anchor. I'll just show you. That's uh, Frank behind me. Turn you around. That's Frank. Julian's already gone in. She'll be on wine already. I can't drink because I'm driving. But there you go. Crown and Anchor. Go and see. Lovely pub. Nice lunch. So we shall go in and have a look. It's a cracking day. Lovely day. Bit windy, but well, there we go. Anyway, here we go. Let's go in and have a look. Nice little spot here. Lovely sun trap in here. Anyway, let's have a look in pub. Let's have a look in the pub. Here we go. Where's our Julian? She'll be having a wine somewhere. There she is, look. <laughs> Good morning. Having a wine. Look at this for a pub. Look at that. I'll just show you this view here. Look at this. Best view in the world, this. Look at this. Absolutely stunning. Absolutely stunning. I'll have a walk down to Kilnsey after this. Anyway, so look. There's your bar area. Real ales. Look at this. Proper real ales. Beautiful. I think David's just gone back into the kitchen. Specials bar. They do some lovely food here. Another big window to have a look out on, on the umber. Nice little room in here. Look. Nice and warm as well. Look at this. Isn't this is the restaurant. Joel, you haven't got a mic on, she'll have to wait. This is the restaurant, this. A bit of a special board. Yeah, I've got a menu. I mean, it's only a small menu in winter, but... Birders pub, this. But look at this. Looking out over Umber there. What a better view. You're not going to get a better view than that, are you? Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. A bit quiet because we're early. That's why we've come early, actually, so there's no... We're not pestering any customers. Look at it. Stunning. And the food is absolutely superb in here. Nice bar, that's what we've got. Wellington's cream floor. A few ciders, Carlin. Blue Moon, Belgian White. But look at these here. Look at these uh, real ales. Beautiful. It has Newsom's, which is a local brewery, sporting a local brewery. Changes that every now and again. So there you go. Nice little room here. This isn't a lovely little sun trap, is this? Look at this. Lovely little sun trap. Big car park. See our Frank over there, look. Right. That's it. I will fetch you back when our lunch comes if there's nobody in or any music and we don't want to be copywriting that's toilets actually. There's our Julian there with wine. Entertainment, they do have entertainment on here. Look. There you go. Won't get any better, does it? David, the landlord. Right, I'll fetch you back when I get my dinner. Right, here we go. Dinner's just come. Look at that. Fish and chips. Mushy peas. Beautiful. What's Julian having? What are you having, Julian? Scampy and chips and mushy peas. Oh, I might try one of them, see what it's like. Get your fingers out of the way. <laughs> Right, try one of them, see what they're like with a glass of wine there. 
This is the view. I need another glass of wine, my darling. Oh, well, wait. I'm doing I'm busy. <laughs> I must admit, though, it's better when it tides in. Isn't it? Look at bird, seabirds going across Umber there. Umber. What a special place this is. I when am right when right tides in and, and when tides in, yeah, we don't live far away from here. When tides in, it's beautiful. And sunsets here are absolutely stunning. But there you go. I've right, just come out there, we've just had lunch. Very nice. Look at this. Excellent. Gillian, what, what, what did you say? What do you think about the lunch? 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10, because she's had a couple of wines. <laughs> very nice wine as yeah, well. Very nice wine, she says. Now look at this. Look, look at them down it. there. Look at them. Yeah, you can't you lot see them on this camera. Too far away. <coughs> be right. very nice if the tide had been in it, it'd have been a lot better, but there you go. Yeah, a little bit of a wind. Down there is Spurn Point. That's the lighthouse down there. Right, let's have a walk down here. Walk this dinner off. Walk this fish and chips off. Let's have a look there. Got to say, if you're ever in Kelsey, just come and have a pint in here. Have something to eat. It's absolutely beautiful. Reasonable price as well. Very reasonable. Let's have a look. Have a look at this board here. So a look, Julian, let me get in. Okay, you can uh, zoom into that so you can read all that. Too many words for me to read. Very nice. And also, hidden holderness. Look at this. Loads of information. Yeah, very nice. What you wish? What you what, what are you whispering for? Telling everybody where we live. Because <laughs> you've been on that wine, <laughs> been on that cocky beard again. <laughs> right, let's have a walk down here. Takes you down to see this. Down to caravan site at bottom, which is sandy beaches. Bird watchers paradise this place and arguably the best well there's our Frank oh. arguably the best place in Britain to see migrating birds and have their own uh, bird watching club up here OBS Observed no BO I can't remember Bird That's Observed a little caravan park Yeah you can actually come in here this is uh, Q Villas. Q Villa, but isn't this on Motorhome and I think it's registered this as a Motorhome site. You can, yeah, it is, look, Canavan and Motorhome. Canavan and Motorhome site there, look, Jill. You guys want to book it? We've got some bird feeders up here. This is where they do all the ringing from. Cue cool Villa View in there, yeah. SBO, that's what it should be. It's Bird, bird Observatory. There you go. Been a member of this for a few years. How many members? How many years have I been a member of this? When did we get our caravan up here? How many years ago? Nine years. We've been together. Well, yeah, but but you, you, you was up here before then. It's got to be I've been here years. since. I've been a member since. Well, fifteen years. It's got to be. It's got to yeah. be at least fifteen years since we bought ours up here. Well, 2006 you bought your first one. 2006, was it? Or two, it was 2006 or 2007. We've got right. to be 2006 because... 
Oh, what's that? That's 16, yeah. Church, yeah. Yes, arguably one of the best places for birds migration, for bird migration. You've already Church, said that. I know, I've said it again. Shut up. Church field. I feed it up here. Yeah, very nice. Bird ringing in progress. Look. That's the sound when the bird ringing. That's the sound when the bird ringing up here do bird ringing de demonstrations in summer i've got to say as the crown and anchor was um quite empty today in summer yeah but julian don't forget we were here at 12 o'clock when it opened i know we, we, was. we wanted i know we do, was we wanted to do a bit of a vlog inside where there's no customers so that's why we came early but in summer it's packed. Oh, in summer it's absolutely, you can't, well, you can't bloody book. They've got outside seating and everything. It's burnt, uh, what's it called? Yorkshire Wildlife Discovery Centre. Yeah. There's a discovery centre down here, which we might walk down to. See how our gets legs are doing. Tell you what, it's really warm. Bird of prey there, but I can't see what it is. I think it's a sparrow hawk. And you certainly, yeah, it is a sparrow hawk. You certainly won't see it on here. Look <laughs> at pigeons just flown up as it's gone past. What were you saying? It's red hot today. Red hot? I wouldn't say it were red hot, but it's, uh, it's pleasant. Very nice. We'll walk down to... Uh, Sandy Beach is at bottom, go to the cliff tops, just show you the, the sea, where they do a bit of fishing and I'm caught for the last twice I've blanked up here. <laughs> Can't catch a fish for life in me. What I mean, did gonna, you say then? I blanked. Oh. I was going to do a fishing video but I've done four. But I can't put them on because I'm copped out. It's useless. Yeah. I tell you, a Jonah. I tell you, she's been on that cocky wine, aren't she? <laughs> been on that cocky wine. <laughs> Dear me, we better get her home and in bed. <laughs> you wish. There's a bit of history around here, isn't there, Jill? There well, is. Well, yeah. Kilsey Village used to be. In the sea. In the sea, actually, didn't it? Yeah, they moved the church to Easington. Oh, yeah. Or a lot of the graves into the Easington. Well, why not this one up here? Because it ain't gone into the sea yet. Here we are. You can... Uh, camping club there. I think it's, it's Sykes' field, so it's part of uh, Sperm Birds. So I don't know if you can stop on this. Incidentally, you can't uh, you can't stop it down an anchor car park, but there is a few campsites. I mean, next door or just a bit further up road, there's driftwood. You can stop on there. There's Westmere Farm. You can stop on there. So there is places to stop. This car park here, I'm sure. Well, there is vans on it now, so you will be able to stop on there. I would have thought for touring site. This is private. Photographed many a barn owl on here. That's where I do most of my photography. Up here, all the surrounding areas. Yeah, you get some special birds up here, migration time. And it's like a funnel, that's why you get the birds. This is where, the, when they're coming across the sea from, uh, where they're coming from. Europe. Yeah, what the Russia? No. Scandinavia and oh, there they come across here. This is first first bit of land to see and this when they're going back, spurn is like a funnel, it just funnels up birds down into down to the point and that's where they feed up before they cross. This is Bluebell Cafe this. Is it still open as a cafe no. Jill? No, they closed it when um they opened the new bird observatory. This is the entrance to Sandy Beaches. 
Nigel's sister and brother-in-law have a van on there. Oh. Got Pauline and Gary. Yeah, no, they do. Yeah, this Blue Bell Cafe. Just have a look at this sign. Spurn Discovery Centre. Just down there. Poets Landscape. So this used to be a lovely little cafe. Bit of history here. Just go across here. This is a waste now, isn't it? I don't know what they use well, it for. Well, I don't for. know what they're doing with this, but... Yeah, Wildlife Trust, so... Have a look. We start, look, 1994. 190 yards from sea. Built in the year 1847. I can't see how, how many yards were that, Jill? 530 summer. Yards away from sea. This used to be a shop and a pub. Yeah, I'm just saying it's 190 yards away from sea now in 1994. Yeah. But look how far away it was then, in 1847. Yeah. It was. First time I got piddled was in there. Excuse me. <laughs> well, then we don't need to know that, Julia. Well, it used to be a pub. Well, Call the Bluebell. Bluebell Cafe. Nice I'm, a, I'm off up. I'll catch you up. Nice bit of information there for you to stop and zoom in if you want. But yeah, interesting how far this erosion's gone now, isn't it? Campsite. Uh, sorry, this is the uh, Bluebell car park with facilities. I don't think camper vans can. Uh, our motors on can stop overnight though, can the Jill? No. Public conveniences. Seaside Road, Seaside Road, can't they? Blue well. No overnight parking or camping permitted. That's men's. That's how much wine she's had, she's just gone in men's. Yeah. I don't know if you can see, but the Discovery Centre's down there, I think. Probably have a walk down there. Yeah, guy looks there for the car park. I don't think my camera's been on. Still here? It is. Let go. Have you turned it off? I went to turn it off when I went in and it wasn't on. Well, it is now. Give me a sound check. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening. Just point that over there, cos... <laughs> I don't know what she's done with it. I don't think it is on now. Well, I don't think you've turned it on. I did turn it on, Julian. But the light's not coming on for some reason. But I know I've turned the lights down. Oh, maybe that's it then. Give me a sound check. Good morning, my fella. No, it's not morning, Jillian. Come here, where are you going? Well, Come here. Check. I can see. We're going whatever. that way. Right. Who said? One, two, one, two. Yes, there's nothing wrong with it. Come on. She's got to mess about with stuff, hasn't she? <laughs> Better leaving it alone. How many, car how many caravans is on this car, remember? <coughs> on uh, Sandy Beaches now. There used to be 178. Whether yeah. there is now or not, I don't know. Yeah, that's a long, long time ago, Julian. I know. It was licensed for 400, but right. half of it is in the sea. <laughs> so you couldn't fit 400 on. Some debris on that beach. Actually, I think we've had some big seas up here, haven't we? See, this is new. I mean, when I came here, this was a road. Forty post, look. 
It's a photo post. These, what, what is it? It's a beacon. It's been binoculars. These wayfinding beacons can be found along the coastal path. Use the phone. Well. Oh, you put your phone, I see. Yeah, so you put your phone in here. Put your phone in there, take a photograph, and then share it on uh, social media. Tide's going out actually now, but look at the ruins. Well, what Sandy Beach is a. Uh, it's an old fort. Old fort. I want, yeah. want it where. Army barracks, army, army yeah. base. Yeah, yeah, just where the entrance is was a hospital. Right. And that bungalow there, my mum and dad lived in there for a bit. Where? where? That bungalow, you can see next to that caravan. Yes, yeah, so I know, but well, that ought to do with army base. Yeah. That was the army base, was it? Yeah. But the surge, when what surge? Tidal surge here. How I many years I ago? Don't, before, before I started coming here. Oh, the one not long ago when it. Oh, when it flooded. When it flooded, yeah. Did all road right up to Crown and Anchor from here. Oh, and these caravans here, it knocked these caravans over. I don't know. I mean, this coastline, all this Before coastline's 2007. gone. 2007. No, it wasn't. Well, it so far back? Yeah. I don't think it was. I don't think it was, but it might have been. I yeah. can remember this beach where you had 15, 20 foot cliffs here. 15, and, 20 foot? Yeah, and they were all, I'd all seen where house martins yeah. were. There would have been house martins, Julian, there'll have been sand martins. Oh, well, sand martins were nesting. Right, come on, let's go and have a walk. This is all part of the old barracks, <laughs> all these. All these ruins? Yeah. Yeah, they get washed out of the cliffs because a lot of them were underground. Most of the overground stuff's been knocked down. Yeah. But there's still a lot to come out that's underground oh, as it goes back. Yeah, there's a few bunkers further down yeah. the road, towards. Uh... The hospitals, most of that was underground. And that's up past the road, the entrance road, it's under there. Right. Let's have a walk down the road to Discovery Centre. Back across the triangle, back to Crown and Anchor. You see, that pond never used to be there. No, they did. They, they dug that pond because of the tidal right. flood, so that gave them a bit of relief, didn't it? That's when we had the tidal flood here, it went right up. Right up to end at Road, and then obviously you've got the Umber the other side. I mean, yeah, where the, where the end of that road, that's the Umber. Yes, I know, but I'm saying it was uh, it was flooded, wasn't it? It was flooded into Kilsey. Anyway, how long is it since they did this uh, discovery centre now down here? Oh, don't know. Be a few years now. Four or five year old bought it. Yeah, I mean, our locals didn't want it, did they? Time goes past, doesn't it? Yep. Yeah, a lot of locals said it'll only get flooded. It's in the wrong place. I mean, look at this. Beautiful. What's that they built up in the tree, is it, for watching? I don't know. Or is it a kid's thing? I think it's just a shed. <laughs> what, up in the tree? It's there for it's a in reason. in case you get another surge. I mean, <laughs> that one in water, under water, wasn't it? They're going to they're gonna move out. into the shed. At least they can go sit in this shed. Tidal surge, you see. Has he got the antique shop open again? I think I don't think it's ever been shut, has it? Yeah. Antiques place there, look. It's there. And this is the road down to Spurs. Which you can't get down to now because it's, uh, when it's high tide, it's an island. 
what they used to call the navvies is just gone. So if you're down on sperm point at high tide, you can't get back until tide goes out. This is the wild bit of the Humber. This is what? The wild bit of the Humber. Where? Spain Point. All this right. is all Spain up here. Is it? Yeah. From that junction is Spain. Right. Car Spain park's Road. there now. Spain Road, isn't it? What? This is all Spain Road. Yeah. What's left of it? <laughs> yeah, what's left of it? Like I say, migration, bird watchers up here. If you like your birds, this is a place to be. They have a migration festival every year. I think it's September. Well, it's Always... starting now, will it, for spring? No, not yet. Not yet. Yeah, migration festival. September they usually get some uh, some nice birds then. I'm not sure but I think there's some uh, two or three waxwings up here this this winter. Beard at ditch you get them. Great snipe, I've had that. Oh that's some cracking birds up here. This is car park here, just on, on the right here, left sorry, Fort uh, Discovery Centre. They used to charge to go in there, didn't they? Have they taken ticket machines down? Pardon? Have they taken the ticket machines down now? I don't know. Because they used to charge. Maybe people stopped coming because it was too expensive. Well, I think it was. I think they charged you a bloody fiver. Not the height still here, but it looks like there's been a lot of rubbish dumped here. It looks like it. Oh, is it out of so, this discovery centre? But it says no entry. Yeah, for cars. Oh, dear me. Yep, a lot of rubbish being dumped here, isn't there? I don't know whether it's been dumped illegally or it's out at discovery centre. But this is where you used to have canal hide. Sperm. There's a bit of canal hide here, I don't know if it's a... You don't think it's they've dumped it, do you? Yeah, I think it's probably... I think it's rubbish what's been picked up from Beach Cleans deal. Oh, because it's all... Uh, I think it's... Like I say, I think it's what they've picked up from uh, Beach. Yeah, canal scrape eye, it's still here, this canal scrape eye. Welcome to the white one. There you go. And there's an eye just down here. Yeah, eye's still here. Bring up a few years, this. Yeah. This is where do a bit of bird watching. I tell you what, that's got closer as well as that was. Didn't used to be that close. All oh, reed beds now, there'll be some nice birds on there. Bird box back there, burn at barn owl box. Yeah, go for photographing. Uh, waders and stuff that. We used to have a board, oh they have got a board up and tell you what's being about. You used to write it down there. Write it all down on here. But there's a bit of an information board down. Through the seasons. You get swallows nesting in here. That's through the seasons, winter. There's a nest. Oh yeah, there's up here. I don't know if the swallows are half martyrs to be honest. Right, come on. Yeah. 
many an hour spent in there with my camera. Not photographing anything. <laughs> Not photographing anything. Yeah, that's some good stuff in there to be fair. This is the uh, sperm discovery centre. Oh, it's smaller than I thought. What, this? Yeah. Have you never been here? No. Cafe's closed, well, what? 10 o'clock tomorrow? Yeah. No, you came up not long after it opened, but I've never been up. Uh, my wife's sightings. You're so excited now. Enjoy a walk that's Snow buntings, yeah, new there with that. And not a lot about winter. Burn mm. Discovery Centre. Looking for it. Unimog. There you go. You can always pause and zoom in on that. Yeah, there's not a lot happening during uh, winter. I mean, they do activities for kids, they do walks, they do uh, beach walks. Yeah, it's only small, isn't it? Beach cleans. It's nice inside, actually. I thought it was huge, all the uproar the one about it. Yeah, they had a lot of uh, bother, didn't they, with locals not wanting it here. Yeah. Oh, it's fairly big. <coughs> <coughs> yeah, it looks nice. It does, isn't it? They've sort of dried up, haven't they, these little, uh, yeah. little ponds of them? It's been very dry, though, hasn't it, it recently? I mean, there is some nice viewing areas at Spur. Let's see. Uh, yeah. And that's, that's the umber. <coughs> that's the umber there, yeah. That's the umber. But on here, you get a lot of bearded tits. And I've been chased by a swan <coughs> that was on... That's the canal, canal, isn't it? On the canal. Bees at work. Well, Gaffy must have wanted us shut, Jill. I don't think Gaffy is shut, I think it's open, look. Yeah. It is open, isn't it? It people, is, isn't it? it? Yep. Well, that's it. Tour over with. <coughs> oh, we're going back to Van now, back to our Frank. Are we going along the Umber? Or along the road? What, you mean along the, uh, around the triangle? Fancy triangle, yep. Be a bit windy if you want, but it's up to Well, you. yeah, we'll go along there. That's long here. <laughs> yep. Right, come on, mate. I've seen deer playing on the beach from there. Yeah, there's a lot of deer, road deer around here. A lot of road deer. I've seen some nice birds in here. The feathered kind. <laughs> <laughs> so, you can have a bike hire, you know, what, ten pound a bike hire. I've got a Cycle bike Cycle to sperm boot, pond. You what? Big bear, Make a difference with the two minutes. Two minute beach clean. Yeah, they even give you the thing of jibs here, look. Very nice. So that's where we are. Well, and yeah, we're good. There's a big sign saying you are here. Yep. <laughs> we're going to walk along there. Back to the Crown and Anchor. Well, that, that is what they call 
The triangle, because yep. it's a triangle. The Kalisi triangle. Yeah. Is it on there as a triangle? No. It's not, is it? No, they haven't, they haven't got this path here. No. Yeah, they have, look. Triangle. Yeah. So is there. Triangle. The triangle. Yeah, a lot of controversy, weren't there, when they built this? There was. This oh. is an old, uh, what is this now? I forgot what they call them, it's... This is from, uh, is it World War One? Yeah. Okay, pillar box. Oh, that's right, the pillar box, look. Canal scrape. Yeah, well, that's, this is a canal scrape. Yeah. Pillar box. And if you zoom in there, it gives you all the information on what it, what it did. Yeah, very nice. You can go round here, can't you? You used yep. to be able to go this way. Well, you did, so... On the triangle. But yeah, a very important one of these. Yeah. What yeah, part one? of the sea defences. World, World War One or two? One. One World War One. Yeah. Birds here. The caravan park, Sandy Beaches, was um, called. It's come back to me. I couldn't remember earlier. Fort Goddard. Fort Goddard. Yeah. Right. So, if anyone wants to look up Fort Goddard. In Kilsit. Another information board here. Yeah, to be fair, there's, uh, there's a lot of wildlife around here, isn't there? He used to come bird hunting. Bird watching, Gillian. <laughs> bird hunting. <laughs> Dear me. That's how you met me. Hi, bird watching. Bird okay, hunting. Pardon? <laughs> you got more than you bargained for. Did I? <laughs> And I'm still paying for it. <laughs> <laughs> right, come on, let's go. This is the triangle now. Back towards the crown and anchor. Just look out there. Where are we? Just look. Is that where Luke? It's Luke, Luke it's beautiful. It is, yeah. Yeah. That's Lincolnshire. Spurn Lighthouse, what? That's Lincolnshire. Lincolnshire over there, yep. Yeah. Yellow bellies. Yellow bellies, you can't be saying that, Julian. <laughs> can't be saying that. On camera. I mean, look at that. You can sit here. Sit on this bench here. Just sit down there and look at that. I can tell you what, there's some spectacular sunsets here, isn't there? There is. Sunsets on Umber, rises over at sea. Beautiful. I photographed some nice uh, uh, short eared owls on here. There we are, got your back. Change your battery. Yeah, they were saying it was going to make a a right impact at landscape, wasn't it? Yeah. But I don't think it has to be fair. Have you noticed though, it's uh, it's all raised up, in it? Yeah. In case it floods. Yeah, but that's for viewing as well. Well, no, it isn't. It is, it's for viewing. Really? It is. It will build. If they built it ground level, you won't be able to see over this hump. Ah, they could have filled it with muck. And built it on the thing. Well, I don't know. I don't know. Probably is, but it's for flooding as well. Very nice. There's some, uh, some ships go up and down there, don't they? They do. Ferry goes up down there every night. Yeah. Goes back every morning. Off to Amsterdam. To Amsterdam. Yeah. Yeah, they stopped the other one, didn't they? Bruges, yeah. Bruges. Yeah, 
you have seen beer that tits on this canal it's great beer on this canal kingfishers surprised we've not seen a deer I know especially with it being so quiet yeah you should get a lot of deer is that an owl box up there yeah I've seen foxes and all sorts running on, on the side here Owls, lovely walking on here on a summer's evening. Watching barn owls hunting, short-eared owls. Right, end of the triangle walk. That certainly walked his dinner off, hasn't it? Where is she? I said, that certainly walked his dinner off, hasn't it? It has. Back to the crown and anchor and back to our Frank. And that's it. And that's another vlog done, isn't it? It is. <sighs> Might do this in summer and show you it in summer. Yeah, it's better in summer. Beautiful in summer here. I mean... They can't hear the wind or feel the wind. I don't know how cold it is, so it will look nice, won't it? Yeah. Let's go across the uh, bridge. Bridge into the car park. Yeah, a nice couple is David and uh, Adrian. David looks after after bar, and Adrian's the chef. I've got to say, they make some very nice food, don't they, Jill? They do. I've never had a bad meal there. No. Oh, to be fair, I've never had a bad pint. And by we've got some beer in there. Right, here we go. Back in. Back to our Frank. Big Bertha. It's Frank. By she looks nice. He, he looks nice stood there, doesn't he? He does. He does. It's a female. Where are you going? In the door. Can you all get in that way? If you open it. No, you can't. Right, that's it. <laughs> Dearie me, I hope that's not on camera. Right, turn it, I'll turn you around, because we've better say goodbye, haven't we? Okay, then. Nice right. to have been with you again. Catch you on the next one. Bye. Which hopefully ain't going to be that long. No. So, say so long. Bye. Bye.